I'm going to be showing you how to detect a Roblox premium membership in Roblox Studio. So um, there is a property in the player object called membership type and this will describe the uh, type of membership that they have on Roblox for the player and uh, this property is only accessible in a server script so you're gonna want to make sure that when you try to get the value of this membership type it has to be inside a regular server script not a local script so um, to illustrate an example of using this property I'm gonna be making a GUI that just enables itself when it detects you have a premium membership so to start I'm gonna make that GUI for my example I'm gonna put it over here put some text on it like you are premium like that I'm actually gonna turn it off right now so you don't see it so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a function called um, is player premium, and we're going to take in the player object for this function. So what I want this function to do is it'll return if the player is a premium status or not. So to get started, we have the player object, which means we can just check if player dot membership type. Now this is the membership type uh, variable that I was talking about, and you can check if this is equal to enum.membershiptype.premium. Now, uh, this will only return true if the player's membership type is premium. So if this is true, then we can return true. Else, we can return false. That's it, that's it for the function. Now, I want to make it so that when a player joins, uh, we can check if the player is premium. And if the player is premium, we can turn on their GUI. So to detect if a player joins the game, we can just do game.players.playerAdded uh, colon connect. And in these parentheses, we're going to make a function that takes in the player. So what this does is it detects when a player is added to the game or when a player joins. And we're going to connect that, which means we're going to run a function. And we're going to put in the player object as well, because the player added event passes along a player object so we can use that player object to check the membership type so if is player premium our player then we're gonna do what we want here so we can set the player dot player GUI dot screen GUI dot enabled equals true so this if statement it runs our function with the player object and it checks if the membership type is equal to the membership type premium. And if that is the case, then we're going to set the screen GUI to be enabled. So um, if we test this, if I press run, uh, let's see if there are any errors. There are no errors. And you can see there is no GUI because I am not a premium member. Uh, so let's change this just to make sure that it is working. We're going to set it to membership type dot none. Okay, and you can see it says you are premium, but I am not premium. It's checking if the membership type is none. So the proper way for this to work is to set this to premium. And here it'll check if the player, when the player joins, is the player premium status. If it is, then you can run whatever code you want in here. You could even put a remote event and call a client or local script to do more functionality. So this is it for the tutorial. This code, the uh, template, is going to be available in the description. So thanks so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Yeah.